All right. So, oh, it's not that they're grayed out. It's just it's region by. Okay. Okay. Welcome back to episode two. Hey, look, the thing. Um, I'm kind of curious since this had the little Egbert thing jumping around. Let's see what this does. Learn to cook. Apply materials. Whoa. The fire going cooked for the first time. Now with the pot, fire, and rain greens, you'll be able to cook a variety of dishes. Do whatever you need sustenance. Wait. Contributions to Hyrule. Complete quests in a region to contribute there. Work together with Denzians across the kingdom to grow stronger and fight against the calamity. Oh. I don't have all that stuff. Okay. But I do have this stuff. One-handed weapon bonus combo. Sword Fighting Academy. With the link provided, the Sword Master built a perfect classroom. Thanks for help. She offered to let him join the class. Oh. Oh. Alright. That's an interesting way to do that. Fair. What's that? Lizifalos. Ah, if only I killed a few more. I have all this. Impa ran across the merchant in the Hebrew region who lamented that it had been years since the last journey home to Kakariko Village. Maybe a few souvenirs leaves his homesick heart. Plus one bonus heart for Impa. Oh, nice. I knew I could do it. Those fireflies and beloved hometown, the merchant's face crinkled into a warm, nostalgic smile. Now that home didn't feel so far away, and he could happily return to work. Oh, absorb some of the strong attack. Okay. So this is an interesting way of doing the character increase as opposed to how they did it last game. Alright. I don't got the stuff for any of these, so I guess we'll move right into the next mission then. Change code weapons character from the party menu. menu as they probably press him plus. Party. All right, training swords better. Come on, man! You got you got to wear your full outfit. You got to wear the full outfit. Like, come on! You're part of you're part of an army, my dude. All right. Nah. Onward. Zelda, curious about the diminutive guardian, decided to accompany Impa on her journey to Pura's research facility in Hateno. With Link acting as bodyguard, they made their way to the ancient tech lab. Wait, isn't this taking place in the opposite direction? Did you never stop learning? I'm pretty sure... Both of the ancient labs are on the right-hand side of the map, and we're going to the left. Unless it's just a case of, like, following roads and stuff. As, you know, they would've. Rods! <laughs> Excuse me. Link is so short. Hmm. Look at that. I suppose all we can do is wait for Robbie and the others at the lab to analyze it. Agreed, Your Highness. Hell yeah, Potlid. Good job, Potlid. Monsters too. Now, of 
all times. <gasps> all right. Wait, blocked off. Yeah, wooden weapons. All right. Moving on. Moving right along. Dig a dung, dig a dung. Foot loose and fancy free. Moblins come from. So we're finding a bunch of lizard pillows. Cool, brought me down to the ground. Nope, I went to do ice. Too late now. And his body's all the way over here. Oh, missed out on a lot of Lizapolos. Tags, or whatever they're called. I'm stuck. Oh, they're all already up there waiting for me, probably. That's fine. Oh, hello, buddy. Nope.
Come on, Zelda. Keep up, girl. You have to take over that. Yes, yes, he is. Go down and around for this one. Okay, let's see. Is there this bottom gate open? Yes, it is. All right, do it. Murder. Where's the big bad? Where's the big bad? Why isn't he spawned yet? Oh, he's probably up there. Didn't realize that was over there. Hello. Goodbye. Um, let's see. How does one even get up there? Oh, right here. Oh, not what I meant to do. All you have to offer guys are lacking I expect more when I come back next time this is a warning you don't take it lightly to slackers look Cora I no, I can't But how you doing, girl?
Yay! Alright. Is that a lightning wrist rope, I'm assuming? Alright, apparently I couldn't uh, stun him twice. All the rods. Come on, there you go. And that should be a moblin dead. Oh, no, no, no. Good on you, buddy. You got some life left in you. Whoops, wrong button. I mean, you'll get the job done at least. button again. I really should switch those two because I keep mixing them up. You know what, Metal Box? You get to live this time. Congrats. Enjoy your newfound freedom. God dang it. Wanton destruction by Link. What else is new? Killian soldiers. And before I activate you, I want to make sure there's nothing up here hiding. Like these chests, I mean boxes. I was so afraid I was about to like accidentally jump right off. Zelda has joined the fight. Link. What the hell? Uh, I'll take over Link. All right, I'm doing it. Interesting, interesting. Yes. <laughs> 
All right, all right, I'm digging this, I'm digging this. All right, three is what gets me the bomb. One, two, and three is bomb. And bomb is arguably the best. Oh, wrong button. I got that picture now in like a photo gallery somewhere. Cause if that's that's a feature of Zelda, then you know she's my best one now. I gotta get all the photos. What no chest? Right there. Okay. Oh cool, they already open. Look, a soup ladle. I got the soup ladle. Yeah, what's up this way? Anything good? Indeed. I can help. Like this. Bunch of dead book goblins. That's what's up here. I wonder if she always comes with like a small retinue of soldiers. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. Oh god. I'm not sure what that just was, but... I mean, it's fair that she has like the least defense. It's fair. It makes sense. What the hell are those? Oh. Really? There we go. One, two, three. Get back. Now this. I love these. I love this. These are great. These are perfect. Oh god. Hello. Thank you. 
Wrong button, wrong button. I don't know how I started flying. I'm honestly not sure how I started flying. But it happened. Hey, an ancient memory part. All right, those are not destroyable. We know this now. See the other loot there is first. Not much, not much. Fair. All right. Well. Like that'd be a link thing to do. You know, can I just jump off here? Um, okay, getting worried for a second. Um, hello. I would like to come through, please. I did it. What? Come on, buddy. Follow me. While I wait. How'd that one barrel get? Pew, 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 pew. I'm glad that those soldiers were able to like at least knock off one of the arms, you know? If they did they were helpful, they were useful. Two of the arms, actually. Look at that. Look at that. Oop. Yep, I walked right into that one. Let's see how this goes. That's right. Stab that metal beast in the eye with the wooden sword. I don't think a wooden sword makes that kind of sound, but, you know. Who am I to judge?
Oh, they got their own evil tiny one going around now? Alright. Hell yeah. Oh, hey! Other weapons. I mean, that aren't just swords. Ooh, nice. Oh, engineering parts. That's what those are. It's for her. Makes sense. Oh, hey, food. This is technology. The likes of which I've never laid eyes on. Which means we've got ourselves a brand new, never before witness. Guardian Battle! <laughs> Hello, Robbie. Devices like the Sheikah Slate, which are amplified by the power of such ancient relics, are but a meager fragment of such technology. I see. That explains why all of us were able to use the Sheikah Slate. In addition, this here doohickey is loaded with data. Information. We can't even fathom. I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah. Check it. Hell yeah, Pura. Extracted some visual data from the Guardian's memory. <gasps> Is that? Yep, no doubt about it. Hyrule Castle after Calamity Ganon has been revived. As you can see, we managed to extract some of the data, but much of it was fragmented. Even so, if I analyze what we received, I may be able to make sense of more of it. This is the ruin the Calamity will bring upon all of Hyrule. If we allow this to pass, I fear all hope will be lost. Even everything we've done up until now likely won't be enough. If I don't succeed at sealing the Calamity... Never. This will not come to pass. Hey. To stop Calamity Ganon, it was crucial that they possess the sword that seals the darkness, the latent power dwelling within the Princess of Hyrule, and the might of the four divine beasts unearthed from across the land. However, the path to victory was strewn with obstacles. Korok Forest, where the legendary sword slept, had been overrun by monsters and the Princess of Hyrule's power showed no signs of awakening. Lamenting the kingdom's plight, King Rome sent his daughter to gather pilots for the Divine Beasts. Alongside Link, whose brave conduct had earned him a role as her knight, Zelda would meet with each of the four candidates. You intend to let this relic follow you around, hmm? Yes. After talking to Pura and Robbie, we thought it would be best. I will remind you once again. Above all else, your duty is of the utmost importance. Are we clear? Yes, we are clear, I understand. And I will honor my duty. <sighs> not sure if I should know what that is or not. It looks like the teleportation room, but that does not make sense.
Zelda, the high rule in whose veins flows the blood of the goddess. She is devoted to researching ancient technology and awakening her sacred power. Oh, choices. Oh dang. The guardian from the future has opened a path to the battlefield from another world. Charlie will attack with new challenges. All right. Wait, what's? All right. Well, we're gonna end episode two here, and we'll start again with whatever this brawny blacksmith thing is. Thank you all for hanging out. Hope you all have a great evening, afternoon, day, twilight, whatever time has to be, whatever we located. And we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.